beautiful work. Why is the, that's a very weird camera to, to, to uh, start the race on. That's a weird one. Uh, hopefully it switches to the end of the straight once we uh, once we start. But yeah, we'll go through your starting grid for today's race, the third round of the Moto America World Series. I am so excited for it to get underway. We've got D Van Lure on pole in the Acura NSX. Fantastic work from him on his first ever round getting on pole. Amazing to see. Then we've got CJ Pants in the Lamborghini on second. Then we've got Jack on third in that Renault, uh, continuing his good qualifying pace. Then we've got Southless on fourth. Then we've got Toddy Games in fifth, one of the championship uh, challengers. Then Sam Malicious in sixth, and WRL Leclerc, the championship leader, in seventh. Not the best qualifying for him. Then Rundle in eighth. We'll see how he can do. Arctic in ninth. GSR Raptor in tenth. YTB Ferrari in eleventh. Then we've got Sear Washington in twelfth. F1 E Reviews in thirteenth. Arsenal FC in fourteenth. And then McGintis on the final row of the grid in fifteenth, obviously with that quali ban. Wasn't able to do any better than that. I believe we're almost ready to go. There we are. We are sinking. We're going to go very, very soon as we have five red lights coming on for the round of Monta. Round three, and it's green. We're going. What a fantastic start from Divan Lure there. Covers off immediately for CJ Pants. CJ Pants gets beautiful drive. The boys jostling through the first corner. CJ Pants takes the lead. Look at that screen. There's a crash in the background. Why to be Ferrari and McGinn? Oh, he crashes the game. crashing in the background. Oh, my goodness. That was <laughs> And one of your views has rolled it down the straight. Very interesting. There's a lot of squeezing going on to the first corner. Jostling about. Uh, WRL Leclerc's got completely blocked there by Toddy and uh, Jack, I believe it was. He drops down to 10th. Allows Raptor through up into ninth. Look at that huge crash. Magita already has loads of damage. And Senior Pants takes the lead. Divan Lure. Then who was that off? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I believe that was Sam Malicious. He's off into the barrier. Down to 12. He's going to have some serious damage on that car there. But we'll move back up to the pack. We've got Southers defending off. Uh, who is that? Toddy Games with uh, Sear Washington just behind him. What an incredible start, boys. As WR Leclerc. Uh, that was a bit of a chicane cut, was it not? Uh, a little bit, but McGintis has somehow made it up to uh, made it up to eighth, even though he's got bloody loads of damage from that start. But what an incredible start! Runner's going to go around his outside. I think he uh, has got unlucky again there. Poor, uh, poor McGintis. Sorry, lad. <laughs> I feel so bad for you, mate. I feel so bad. What, oh, what's happened there? What's happened there? Arctic has gone. Arctic is down in twelfth. He's had a big crash. Sorry, I missed that. I switched from uh, switched from Arctic to the front running lads. So missed that crash from the Arctic there. Not sure. Not too sure what happened. Arsenal. And uh, it's Arsenal for position. Oh, no, no. Oh, boys. Come on. What was that? Oh, lads. Arsenal there was in uh, eighth position. And the back markers, Arctic and F1 Reviews, trying to repass him. And uh, not doing the best job of doing so. Oh, okay. These guys are very close again at the front. One tenth in it. With Divan Lure getting a fantastic exit out of the Sebastian Vettel Spinala corner. Uh, with uh, battles going on between first and second and third and fourth at the front. So I think we'll, uh, I think we'll stay here for a little bit longer, chaps. With Divan Lo really, really not uh, being able to get the straight line speed out of that Acura. He's clearly faster in the corners. I'm, I'm, I'm sure Senior Pants won't mind me saying that. That Lambo, I've driven it, I drive it in a league as well, and it is a dog in the corners. As these guys are nip and tuck again, further allowing Southless, further allowing Southless to uh, to catch up to the back of them. But Divan Lo just not quite being able to make this move. He's all over him. He's not quite able, quite able to make it stick. And uh, we've seen it. We have seen him pass him but not able to stay in front. Senior Pants is always able to cover him off and get back in front again. But again, as I said, we're moving on to uh, sort of the pit stop period of when people are naturally going to be want to pitting. If he has pitted, then he's looking very pretty as Senior Pants comes out of the pits. That would make sense. Senior Pants has just come out of the pits now. He's jumped a lot of time on Divan Lowe. Look at that, yeah. I told you Divan Lowe would have to add more fuel. There we are. He's had to add way more fuel, so he's lost a decent chunk of time to, uh, to CJ Pants there. And Jack, I know he's pitted. So he's done very well there, out in sick. Past Divan Lure. Divan Lure has had an absolute mare there. Oh, Southers comes in the pits one lap later. Toddy Games continues on for another lap. Halfway through the race now, onto lap 11 with Toddy Games leading. Obviously leading on track, but he is not pitted as of yet. As WRL Leclerc also comes in the pits. So it'll be good to see where he comes out. And Rundle, he is uh, coming down the straight currently. Uh, with CD Pants just behind, then Jack behind, and then D Van Lure. So I believe if someone could clarify it, they've seen uh, in the stream where I haven't been noticing if uh, Rundle has pitted or not. Because if he has, this would be an absolute stormer from him. 
coming from, uh, he was in about fourth or fifth, I think. Slightly so had uh, fallen back. And now he's done fantastically as Southless is coming to the end of the pit lane. But Rundle has managed to come through. Take that second place from him. Southless coming out the pits now, getting the power down. Senior Pats is coming down the pit straight. Southless is going to want to cover him off for the lead. He holds the inside. Senior Pants with a grunt in the Lamborghini, though. Goes for a dive. Can he hold it around the outside? No, he isn't quite close enough. But some lovely battling there from those two for second place. Deciding the podium. And then uh, there's, it's still 11 seconds back to fourth place. So even if these guys do have... Uh, oh, as I've just noticed in the background, D Van Lure and Sam having a lovely battle for sixth place. Uh, even if those guys, uh, those two at the front for, uh, for second place do somehow uh, take each other out at some point or uh, go off or spin or something. Still about 10 seconds, 11 seconds back to fourth place and they can still, they can still get back and going and pick up that podium. The senior pan still setting a lovely lap time. Best, uh, best, best lap delta so far this race. And still going nip and tuck on the second last lap. Sear Washington uh, has come out of the pits and uh, allowed these boys through so, that, so that's always good to see. Oh, he's got... Oh, no. Sear Washington has pinned it in the background. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. A little bit of a bank crash wallet there from Sear Washington. Very frustrating. And that will mean, if I check my Excel document just to make sure I'm correct, that will mean that we'll have, we will have have three different winners from the first three races, which is so fantastic to see. Obviously, Toddy Games winning the first race, W.R. Leclerc winning the second, and now possibly Rundle winning the third. But he comes on to the final lap. But I will, I'm going to look back to this battle as uh, um, who is that? That is a Raptor getting involved in the battle slot there. Glad he's got out of the way but uh, Jack possibly looking up the inside into the first corner he's close. Is he close enough though? He goes for the move up the inside into the chicane TJ Punch is going to try and hold it on the inside for the left hander though. They're both going to try and get good grunt out this corner as uh, Jack gets the better exit, but Senior Pants, obviously, with that Lambo, going to look for the inside around the sweeping right-hander as he does so. Gets his nose just tucked in. They're going to go side-by-side side around the right-hander. This is fantastic racing on the last lap of the race. And they're going to go side-by-side side still into this left-hander. The Senior Pants seals it round the outside. Late on the brakes there. Lovely move. Parks it on the apex. As a, what, what, what's Raptor doing there? He's, he's in a world of his own. But uh, fantastic move there from Senior Pants. Taking it back up into second place. Lovely move. And Jack's lost a little bit of time there on that corner. And has allowed Senior Pants to retake second. A little dice on the final lap for the uh, proper top points paying positions. But Senior Pants gets a bad exit there. Allows Jack to, uh, to close in a little. I'm just looking at the time sheet quickly. That this is the only real battle on track for position that we're going for. Jack really pressuring CJ Pants now into this left-hander, but two straights to come. As we know, the Lambo very, very good on power, so Jack is really going to have to hook it up through these corners to get a good exit. He is slightly off uh, the rear of, uh, of CJ Pants there, but hopefully some slipstream can help him out down this straight. The final corner, the Parabolica, is going to be his only chance. He's closing in. He's closing in. He's very close. Is he going to go for it? He is! He slings out the inside, round the right-hander, rubbing his race in, boys. He's got it round the outside, but CJ Pants, obviously, with uh, with a grunt, out the final corner. Rundle takes uh, the, the race lead for this race, but he takes the win, and CJ Pants are going to go side by side across the line. Who's going to get it? The Lamborghini's got the grunt! Oh my goodness! The Lamborghini's going to take it on the line! CJ Pants! Wow!